think sometimes we try too hard to erase yesterday and we go through the pages of yesterday and we want to erase it and we do so many things just to just to erase it just to get it away and we stumble across um, how we were raised and getting stuck in limiting beliefs and we trying so hard to erase what brought us to this point and sometimes we can't erase things we can't erase things but we can write over it yes and by doing that, I'm not meaning suppressing it and just ignoring it. But making peace with it and writing a new story. Every day you have the opportunity to write a new story. And if there's something that you want to erase that's like, really it's it's hurting you it comes to the surface as resentment as anger as unforgiveness and you cannot sleep and you cannot move forward and it feels like it's eating you up inside then you use love as your eraser use love if there's anything that you then want to erase Use your eraser of love and replace all of those feelings that you are carrying and harboring with love. Because then, if you flip through the pages of the past, then it will be love filled. You will most certainly have more peace about it. Yes, and then you can still write new stories over it. Stories that are filled with compassion and understanding and empathy. And seeing God in that. Because that's what the universe does, isn't it? Whenever we move to a place of vulnerability, of, of forgiveness, of healing, then we feel all this love being poured out on us. And we are so blessed and so grateful and the love is, is, is unexplainable. The love and the peace, when you get to that place of peace, when you feel the divine love being poured all over you, you cannot explain that to someone else. So if we are the recipients of that, then why aren't we allowing ourselves to be more in that space? Why aren't we allowing ourselves to be more in the space of writing over our stories with love and spending less time on trying so hard to erase everything everything that has happened in our lives up until this point don't erase it don't erase it don't try so hard to erase it that it keeps you stuck on those pages because you're spending all of your time trying to erase it. Spend all of your time writing over it with love until you have peace about it. And when you are in peace, when you are in love, when you are in forgiveness, then you see behind the scenes everything that you need to receive about that situation he who sees God 
he who sees that everything is connected and everything will look differently. Archangel Shamuel is the, is the angel of peace and unconditional love and replacing what is lost in our lives. And so for this day, how about just letting all of the past go and treasure them and love them as a memory today. If you had no past, what will you create now? And that does not mean by any means not considering your past. But it does mean bring in the eraser of love. Make peace. Write over it a new story and treasure the memories. But don't live there all the time because you're holding on to those pages too much. Don't deny yourself the gift of today. Don't deny yourself the gift of a dream. Don't deny yourself the gift of just being here and being present. And bring in the gifts of peace and love. You will find that all of the struggling and all of the effort replaces itself in a completely different light. He who sees God. I'm seeing the image now and maybe someone that is tuning in now feels like that. But I'm seeing the image of, of someone trying to erase this page in the book so much and, and really sobbing and their hands are so tired of trying to erase. It's, it almost feels like it's hurt and it's anger and it's almost like that vibration of I'm hating my life. I just want to erase this. And the hands are tired and the hands cannot even hold the eraser anymore and as much as they're trying to erase it just comes back and appears on the page again and then they erase again and it appears on the page and then we erase and it appears on the page and if this resonates with you stand back just stand back just drop that eraser just Stand back, drop it, and take up a golden pin. And in that gold, with that golden pin, start writing over that page whatever you want to bring in. You need to receive in this moment that you need not to hold yourself a prisoner to that and that you do not need to wait to write with the golden pen until all of that is erased. Beloved, we cannot do that. What we can do is start grabbing the golden pens of our lives and starting to write new stories over it. And as you're writing with that golden pen, that which you want to bring in, you will see that love will erase that for you. 
and every time that you are going to try and go back to that page you will read about forgiveness you will read about the healing power of love you will read about how light saved you you will read about the start of a new story a new story of your life starting now isn't it amazing to to just work with the energy of Archangel Shamuel to see things a little bit differently because beautiful divine being that is why you chose this journey not to have it all perfect but to learn how to write stories to learn how to write new stories to learn how to write with a golden pen and to learn how to receive love 